To look at the stem and leaf diagram, we'll first create a data set using the normal distribution tool. You can choose the parameters for your data set, such as its mean or standard deviation. Then click the Generate Samples button to produce your data. To add a stem and leaf diagram, drag it from the Charts and Graphs folder. To adjust the size of your graphs, simply drag on the bottom right corner. Click on the Frequency tab in your data table to show the Frequency table. Click on a row in the Frequency table and you will see the corresponding entry highlighted in the stem and leaf diagram. You can also click on an entry in the stem and leaf diagram to highlight it in the Frequency table. Clicking on a group in the Frequency table opens its Properties pane. You can edit how your data is grouped by changing the interval setting. To highlight all the numbers in a group, click that group's row in the Frequency table. Clicking a number in the stem and leaf diagram still highlights the corresponding row in the Frequency table, but the highlight is paler if you've not selected all of the members of that group. When all the numbers in the group are selected, the row highlight becomes darker. Select the Sample tab in the dataset. Here you can set the parameters for your dataset. For example, change the standard deviation. You can then generate a new sample. 